because my face looks like in excruciating pain, it just comes with the territory. I mean, look at this. This is next level stuff. I'm Hunter. I've got eight Ascendant Audio Reference 2 15s on eight Kicker 2400s at 1 ohm, two JY Power cased 80s, and then two Custom Electric Service alternators. And a lot of people will probably give you some props for using Kicker. Is there any story behind using a bunch of Kicker, or is that just a preference? Well, I was in the market for amps, and I asked Travis, he's like, bro, why not Kicker? I was like, that's a great idea. This trim panel, it's not attached to the actual box. It floats on it because it's a pickup truck. So when you go over turns, it's gonna tweak and stuff. So when I'm going down the road, you can actually see this move around. It's all bolted and pressed on with weather stripping. Seals it off without actually being attached to it. And then there's a big step down all the way around where it comes from the bed and then goes into the cabin. So that's pretty much it. It's just a fourth order, really. I might just adjust the loading wall depth wise. Might scoot it back a little bit and you know test what that does. And your doors seem pretty extreme too. Can you tell me a little bit about the doors? They're all steel. There's 16 pound density expanding foam that we poured into the doors. We had to lay them down on the ground and not do too much or else the windows wouldn't roll up. That passenger side door is completely messed up. I'm gonna have to figure out something with the latches. I know adding all the weight, it sagged the door down. Now I'm gonna have to remove the latch back down. The things we do for base, huh? Yeah, man. <laughs> Thing was brutal, making me tap out like a freaking wimp over here. No shame in my game though, that was plenty enough bass for me, thank you very much. But this next clip, oh my gosh, this next song, something about this bass line had me vibing like a madman. What is it called? Black Mold on Blast, baby. <laughs> so much fun right now. Out for a second, All right. right, that's so much different than last time. The lows are so much different than I'll last time. I'll be nice to you, but get on the passenger Okay, wow. Freaking Hunter Martin, I know you're at your hotel right now, but dude, 
I love what you've done with the place. Whatever he did was a welcome change because those lows, oh my gosh, they just came to life. And this was only filmed like one year apart. You probably noticed how his subs randomly changed, then suddenly inverted. Well, besides chucking in a set of custom door panels, he ended up testing some double Ds as well with four big boys up back. But if you're just a diehard kicker fan, Showtime Electronics is fully stocked and ready to ship. <sighs> now let's go ahead and embarrass myself one last time with another tap out inside Hunter's sub box. Oh boy. Inside. Hunter Martin's box with his many a subwoofer by the head. Oh my god. This is gonna be interesting. The girl before me was sitting in here like a champion, so we'll see how I fare. I'm gonna have to be holding like this. But don't worry guys, I'm actually enjoying myself. It just because my face looks like an excruciating pain, it just comes with the territory. I mean look at this. This is next level stuff. Like this is like some sort of like torture chamber worthy stuff. Bring in criminals into something like this, they'll be saying no thank you in no time. How long have you been back there? Huh? How long have you been back there? This was my second time ever. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so by show of hands, how many people would say yes to popping in something like this? Literally, I'm in Indian style. This is this is crazy. Would you do something like this? Yeah, I know most of us would, but there's a good portion of people watching right now, hey, how's it going, that think this level of bass is just absolutely ridiculous. And if you're one of them, hey, it's okay. But man, maybe you just haven't had the right experience yet because this stuff is so fun. Because after all, why even go jumping dirt bikes, go white rotter rafting or racing cars, right? It's dangerous. I guess adrenaline rushes come in all shapes and sizes, so whether you're getting a shinner from a pop shove it or a dinger from parkour, everybody has their own mental escape. Besides bass, I really love skateboarding and messing with RC cars. Oh, I'm so glad you did. Plus playing with my good old kit. Get him my creep. Get it. Let me know your three favorite pastimes, and if you do share, I'll pick a random comment or two as surprise winners, just like we did last week with Daniel Rumi. The dude was so humble, he didn't even want a prize, but I'm not taking no for an answer, so I'm packing up a goodie bag from Showtime Electronics for the man himself. Thanks for engaging with the channel, dude. Now let's turn the page onto one of those more ominous moments when you find out that your cabin isn't fully sealed like you thought it was at full blast. Holy heck, I'm working here. Remember five years ago when JP's girlfriend broke Bowman's golden rule? Well, that golden rule applies to a lot of different setups and it's the topic of today's trivia as we push play on Heather Morris's demo. Let's just see how many people know the importance of knowing if a door is accidentally cracked open. Roll that beautiful bean footage. Didn't your harmonic balancer fall off or something? Yeah, we ran over it on the way here.
Woody's going through it too. <laughs> it's affecting my whole skeleton. Thank you so much. Good sir. <laughs> I'm telling you, Hunter Martin knows his stuff. Huge prop to the guy. I can't decide which setup I like better, the kickers with the AAs or the Phi Audios with the DDs. Both setups were monsters, but I gotta say, I really did like the way the kickers looked all stacked up back there, looking beautiful. Mm. So if I had to choose holy freaking sunlight, I'd probably go with the kickers for sheer pleasure. I really liked that layout with the lows that came a year after. So let's go ahead and wrap this video up with one more final song it's a perfect choice because we can compare it well as good as we can on video to the last setup it is called oxy cotton baby full blast Yeah? Yeah, the other one was enough. Oh, you hear something else or are you good? I'm good. No, there okay. you got some uh, you got some other people waiting to get yeah, in here. I'll yeah. I'll let the I'll spread the wealth. But guys, more glass shedding. Looks like the gorilla tape is doing its job though. Uh you had yeah, some. Hunter, Hunter was trying to just test it out to see if it worked in like the first the second or third slot just popped. So, ah, yeah. Dang it. Yeah. Man, Hunter. He's a beast, man. I love that dude. I love him too. Great guy.